Hey YouTube, Tom here from Beyond Examination. Today we're going to be looking at the UAG Plasma 3 layer protection case. Um, there's a lot of rugged cases out there right now for the Note 9, but what I've always liked about uh, Urban Armor Gear is their cases can stand up to a lot of punishment, but they still look cool. A lot of them just end up looking like big blocks of plastic, so they have the advantage in the looks there. So we're going to take a look at how this actually looks on the beautiful Note 9 that I just finally got. Um, let's see here, first looking at the box, you got your military drop test approved. And then on the back, we could look at some of this stuff here. Impact resistant, feather light, easy access to your buttons, anti-scratch, screen surround, and glare free, flat, uh, glare free flash, so it shouldn't affect the flash on your phone. But, um, yeah, so let's go ahead and open this guy up. Right off the bat, I really like the feel. It's not super slippery. There isn't a ton of grip, but um, it's I don't feel like it'll slip out of your hand. And because it is this darker gray instead of clear, it doesn't pick up or show at least the fingerprints you see on clear cases quite a lot. There's your buttons there. It's got a very decent, you don't see this a lot, a very decent lip on the top and bottom. So if, God forbid, you were to drop this face down, it would hopefully hit that first. And some pretty generous cutouts there. So go ahead and put this inside. And... It feels very solid. I'm not going to lie, it does add some uh, bulk to it, but it almost is a welcome bulk. Like, this feels very solid in my hands now. Um, looking around the sides here, we've got, let's see how responsive these buttons are. So I can feel my buttons. They're very clicky. So that, that's nice. A lot of times, the only thing is, um, I will say, is they kind of do get lost on the side because there is so much detail and little fun stuff to make this look all high tech. You, even though this is textured, I still kind of lose it because it is a little bit flush. And then you have all these little squares of plastic that kind of feel like it. So if you're not looking, but then again, I find it pretty easily. So that's not too big a deal. You've got your cutout for the microphone on top. Very generous corner guards. Uh, what they did really well here is these corner guards don't dig into your hand or make it feel like you're holding it. It's too wide. I had a uh, caseology cases where the corner guards were so massive that it made it uncomfortable to hold. But these are really well done. And then, of course, on the back here, it lets your color show through which is nice. I haven't really seen the color of my phone since I got it because I had it in a black case. So it is nice to finally see a little bit of that color without it being so in your face. And it just, I can't get over how solid this feels once it's inside of here. I really feel like this could take a drop. I can't say that with a lot of cases. A lot of times if I get a case, it's mostly just to add some grip, which just does add a slight amount of grip. But this, I really do feel like this could stand up to some punishment. And it looks cool as well. Um, something else I've noticed is actually the corner guards here, not only are they going to protect your, your, your face of your phone, it's slightly raised at the back too, so that these four corners become almost like feet. So when it's laying face down on a table, you're not completely making contact with the clear plastic and getting it scratched up. It's very subtle, but it's there. You can see that it kind of goes up. But really, um, a nice looking case, and I really think so far out of all the cases I've seen, this would offer the most protection. I really, really enjoy it. Um, like I said, it does add a bit of bulk, but the return is really nice on that. And it just looks amazing. As for getting the S Pen, sometimes it's a little hard in cases, but here I just push in, it pops out. Easy as anything. Back in again. So that is not a problem. There 
lip as you can see right here, but if you come from the back side and just pop it out and then take it from the back, you're fine. Well, that's it, guys. Uh, if you can, please like, subscribe, share, and comment. Everything helps out the channel. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram at edgelimited13. Always posting something fun over there. And again, thanks for watching.